Okay, MLB 14 is out, and there was any way I wasn't going to do at least a rough to the show in a franchise mode. Now, this is act this is episode one, but it's actually episode three. Uh, because of YouTube's I content ID system and some other thing, and so the, I tried to you know have the audio low enough on the TV that you can barely hear it, but the playlist that I set up in the game still got picked up by the mic, so I, you know, so after it went through, it got flagged, I tried their little thing to get rid of the stuff, it didn't get rid of the stuff, so just to make things easier, I deleted the first two episodes, but... I will get into Crane Clear Utilities. Alright. This is our Bronson Show player. His name is Thomas Wade. He's a second baseman. Uh, after the prospects showcase, he was drafted in the third round by the New York Mets. And okay. And as you can see why I uh, that I've done I had some tra trainings done. Um, now as you can see he's on the big up ten maps because he is in because he is in double A. Well and so we are going to get to first appear. Uh, back control. Yeah, let's do this, actually. You receive only fastballs and be told these execution fish fire to be thrown. It's a ball that requests the zone of the field. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think this may be the first epic battle I have in the series. <laughs> okay. Let's do this game. Oh, and I probably shouldn't have the train have the TV on while the train is going on. Let me just see. Does it? Yeah, it does. Oh, I was told exactly where it was gonna go, and I still missed.
What? 1400 wasn't good enough for a medal? Really? That's a little uh, ridiculous to tell you the truth. Skip this and welcome back to our minor league preview show as we move closer to the start of Eastern League action with tonight's installment of the Bowman Prospect Spotlight. Thomas Wade is our focus. Making his double A debut in this one, so this is probably an exciting day for him. Well, I'm sure it is, but you know he's got a long road ahead of him in the major leagues. What in the top draft is likely won't be on the fast track in the show. Unless, of course, he starts really putting up big numbers in the minor leagues. Still, I know the organization has said they were happy to get a chance to draft him, so maybe they feel he could blossom into a solid player so It takes a lot of hard work, resiliency, and determination to make it to the big leagues. His journey starts today, so we'll see how it goes. All right, three game festivities to wrap it up. It's time for baseball, and we'll have it for you. Retreats to the outfield grass, and he has it for round number one. Wait, 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 wait. 
Perfect. Perfect. That'll be perfect. And then, uh, yeah, I'll put some stuff into, into that. Put some points into the other stuff later. Ladders. 
<laughs> yeah, I would need to be standing on one of those worm ladders. Okay. That was a good pitch. Let me just see something. Um, sliders. Ah, yeah, I had a feeling. Alright, well, I'll just play without them and then I can always load them in later. Now, a big swing as this is popped up. You can, and I mean, way up there is where the right side of the infield. Delgado is under it to tuck this one away. Yeah, I probably should have taken that pitch, but oh well, I didn't. notification but I don't know where Center on the other teams. Sea Dodger, 3 0, huh? What are we? Oh, and 2! Wait, wait, wait. If we're 0 oh, and 2, shouldn't we? See, that's the weird thing. How can we not be. <sighs> Stupid hat, ain't crap. So maybe that'll help. Thomas, 
half of the floor. I'm shading myself a little closer to second base in case he steals. Whoa! You know, maybe I should work out my arm accuracy next time. It's... Yeah, the next episode is going to be at the end of this 
of this series here, and then the games against Erie. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to actually record any of the away games. I haven't decided that yet, but... But, that said, hope you enjoyed this first episode of the Thomas Wade Road to the Show as a second basis for the New York Mets. And uh, be sure to like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Donate if you can. I know I pushed that, but I mean, it really will help me out. To if, if, if you donate whatever you can, it will really help me out to get the, you know, the capture cards, the mics, the, all the stuff that, you know, the big league YouTubers have, you know. You know. So, that's going to be the end of this episode. And uh, as Mr. Boss with his, for the win would say, Thanks guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.